Well, everyone, you might be trying to figure out how you can get verified on Twitter. Now, this is probably going to change very soon. So what I would recommend doing is pretty much going through and keeping your Twitter application up to date as often as possible. And the reason I say that is because, well, if you're online, it's a little different. But if you're going through and updating your iPhone or Android version of Twitter, usually they're going to be coming out with Twitter Blue, a new version of Twitter Blue, which is going to allow users with verification or if you want to get verified, they'll give them the ability of basically buying verification, which is like $8 a month if you're on Twitter Blue. So keep that in mind. Regardless though, currently the main way to go ahead and get verified is at least by following these specific instructions. So you have to be pretty much authentic, you have to be notable, and you have to be active. So that is basically how you can go with the, get the badge. But to apply for verification, what you want to do is you want to navigate to your profile icon and you want to open up the main menu of Twitter. You want to click settings and privacy. You want to select your account and you want to select account information. Now I've tried this before. I never applied for verification, but I'm I am personally able to see that specific option come up. I don't know if every single person is able to see that. So that is the big thing to keep in mind. But regardless in this specific situation, all you have to do, but in this specific situation, all you have to do is go ahead and follow these instructions and you should be good to go. Now, the categories for verification, you have a few different ways. You can either be government, so you can be like an actual government country or whatever, you news organizations, so you know this includes individuals and news and journalists. You can be a company, brand, and organization, entertainment, sports and gaming, activity, activists, and, organize, and organizers, and content creators and influential individuals. Now, it's probably going to be a majority of people watching this video. Now, in the eligible accounts, this is a big one. You cannot be like a parody or newsfeed or commentary, those types of situations, platform manipulation, accounts or individuals associated with coordinated harmful attacks or, you know, hateful content. So those things are those people not only will probably not be, you know, given verification, they make it banned on Twitter as well. So that's probably a big thing to keep in mind now. And then they also say accounts that, you know, harass and all these other things. So typically anything against their terms of service and or parody accounts, they will not be, you know, given verification and they probably won't even be, you know, on the platform for too long. So that is basically how to do it right now. But like I said, with Twitter Blue coming around, with verification coming for everybody, very soon we're going to be in a situation where that's probably going to make a you know it's going to change these instructions a little bit that's why i would recommend keeping your twitter app up to date and or looking through twitter's you know personal website so you can go ahead and see exactly when they're making these changes so that kind of covers it up if you have any other thoughts or questions let me know in the comment section below hit the like button that would mean so much but definitely hit that subscribe button more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then